What's up, Machinima? Machinima respawn viewers. This is Snipernator. You are watching my Call of Duty 4 Modern Warfare 2 gameplay on Quarry. We are playing Domination, my favorite game type. Mainly what I I play is Domination and Team Deathmatch, Ground War, because I just like I just like the amount of people you play with. It's just it's just more exciting to me. Um, start this game you know I don't do that great and to tell you the truth uh, I'm really not trying too hard I'm just trying to have a little fun with the game you know I've had a few frustrating games before this one and I'm just trying to uh, just try some new things out you know just run around a little more and I'm also gonna try a few crazy shots you know y'all might ridicule me for that but you know I can take it just trying to have a little fun you know when you get too serious it, it just takes the the whole base the whole fun of the game out of it and uh, don't get me wrong I, I like to get serious with the game you know I think I think it's even more fun to get serious sometimes but you also got to even it out you also got to be you also got to lighten up sometimes and uh, I do recommend that for some of you die hard gamers um, this map is a pretty cool map. Uh, it's not my favorite map, but Infinity War did a great job with this map. It's, it's real versatile. Okay, right here I get a nice jump falling shot. That really looks sweet. And it's a little harder to do than uh, than it may look. Um, I suggest uh, that you guys try some, just try it out, just have fun. You know, you might have your KD might be horrible, but you know who, who cares really. Pop shot. So you can tell I basically don't have any, any strategy. I'm just running around, you know, jumping off of houses and shit. having a jolly old time but right there oh man the crosshair was right on his body when I pulled the trigger uh, sometimes the bullet does not go exactly where the crosshair is especially when you're falling from a long distance or if, you're, if you swing a sniper around it depends on what your sensitivity is um, my sensitivity I play on two since this is my first Call of Duty game I've ever played I'm not that used to it you know so I've tried it on um, Higher sensitivities and it's just it just does not work out for me. Higher sensitivities are are better for me for maybe close range combat, but once you start trying to aim all the way down the map, it's really difficult. Uh, the higher sensitivity is, so I like to stay on two. It's, it seems to do well for me. And going back to my perks, uh, using sleight of hand is an absolute requirement. Stopping power is also a requirement because it kills me to have to shoot somebody twice in the chest with a sniper rifle. It just kills me. You get enough hit markers as it is with stopping power, you know, much less without. And Commando Pro, the main reason I have Commando Pro is for falling damage. You know, obviously I'm going for these crazy snipes, and if I didn't have that, yeah, I'd die. Boom, you get a nice shot on that guy. Man, I wish I could have seen that guy's reaction whenever uh, he watched his kill cam. Hopefully he did. I uh, missed that little jumping shot right there. I don't know how. Um, but lucky he was distracted with my teammate and I was able to jab him in the heart. <laughs> that was cool. <laughs> so this is about the point when I realized that I'm actually doing pretty well. And 
I decide to start actually playing smart. So I'm on a pretty good kill streak right here. Alright, so there I get my Harriers. And it, the good thing about this bot is they can only really come from two ways. You know, straight ahead and, you know, come from my right. And I know my teammates are, are to my right, so I know they're not going to come from there until maybe they die. And I just don't want to risk it, you know. I got my Harriers up in the air doing work, and I'm just going to let them keep working. It would just be stupid to run out there. All right, got my chopper gunner. See what I can do with this baby. You know, I really can't remember one time, you know, here recently where my chopper gunner has not been shot down. Like people just, you know, they're just getting good and they know that once I kill him, it's very easy just to switch over, rip out that stinger, and boom. I get a few kills with it, though. Alright, there we go. I get taken out, and I'm like, damn. So now, here we go again. I'm getting a little nervous now because I know I have almost like 20 kills. So now I'm going to have to get the rest of the kills myself, which is very hard because this is the point where you get nervous and your hand gets a little shaky and your shot is just not quite as good. Get a nice little shot right there. That was clutch because he could have killed me and that would have been it. And right now I'm thinking, you know, that it's really funny about... You know, normally I'll go into a match with my little tryhard hat on, my tryhard shirt, my little tryhard boots, you know, going for a nuke. And you just come up unsuccessful over and over again. And here I am going into this match, you know, not giving a damn, just jumping off the buildings and shooting people and just running aimlessly around. You know, and here I am, uh, a, a few kills from a nuke right now. And I'm, I'm just dumbfounded. I'm like, well, maybe I should do that more often. And um, and that's the key, you know. Uh, if, if if you just try to have more fun with it a little bit, don't worry about your kill death. Just go into the match, you know, have fun. And once you do start building your kill streaks up, then you know, hit the switch. So that's my advice to you as a gamer. Alright, so I'm just hoping nobody's gonna shoot me. I see a guy. BAM! Tactical nuke. Headshot. Oh man, it just don't get too much sweeter than that. I just love hearing that sound. That eh sound. And here, I can't move. I just dropped the controller. I'm just amazed that, you know, I got a nuke on the game that I really didn't even give a shit about. So, so my final score is like 41 and 9. You know, which isn't too bad. But, uh, that's it. So if you enjoyed this, uh, leave me a comment, you know, rate. I really do appreciate all the comments and the ratings. And I really encourage you to uh, come to my channel. I'm going to be uploading a lot of gameplay. Uh, so check me out. My YouTube channel is called Snipinator Gaming. Thank you, Machinima. Peace out.